So I already done a video on scrapping a DVD drive, but it was an old version, old um, DVD drive, vintage one, and it didn't really show much. So I thought I'd do a newer one, a video with a newer one. It would look a bit better. Sometimes you have them on the side, have screws on the side. If I can get my there they go. take them off. Really quick to do a DVD drive. She got two screws there. Oh, four. Two of the screws right there. So you take your board out, as you can see, it's not as nice as the board we were getting from. The old one is still a nice of all than average again, but not quite as nice. So we've got our cable, two tabs, just move out the way, and then you can pull your motor out along with this brown board that will be on the other side. It's got like an elastic thing at the bottom. Holding it in which makes it a bit harder. There you go. And then as you can see the screws are little screws there and it's not worth changing your screws either for it. Just because it's the smallest motor ever. So you've got a little brass prong, sometimes they're steel, so check it with a magnet. These, if it's the larger ones which you can get your screw in straight away, might as well do it, just because it's a few seconds to get. A decent size motor but it's still not worth much it's not even really pennies barely pennies it's worth it's got a little motor okay well there this part i leave on even though it's got some bond wires gold bond wires it's just not worth your time so all i do now let's line it up the screws back in. The older one I done took so much longer for some reason. And then we're done. That goes into the steel pile. Scrap steel. If you get a lot of steel they're not going to mind about that little bit of plastic in there. So you can move this cable. So you've got the tiniest bit of cable ever, <laughs> worth a couple of grams. And then you get your two boards, one main one and then one which just has a um, tactical switch for silver, uh, LED which might have some uh, a gold bomb wire in. These can have gold and then you've got your motor. You might as well... It's not worth taking the copper out of these motors, they're tiny. That's what I do, you just snap them off and then you've got your motor for your motor pile and then you can just take whatever off that and throw the rest in the bin got your nice board and then you got your brass prong so you just get your magnet and test it find my magnet. pause the video a second find the magnet all right so there's a magnet you can see completely non-magnetic so that's brass you can get silver colored ones which are also brass they're just plated so there's another one there again it's just brass but sometimes they're just coloured. Uh, yeah, that's all we do. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below on any video ideas you have. I'm slowly tied in this area. That's why it's so messy. I've only just got it and I'm trying to get rid of everything. It will be gone soon. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below on any video ideas you have. Thank you. Bye-bye.